What if I told you the closest alien world we've ever seen is right next door and your grandkids could actually visit it? Just four light years away? That's nothing in space terms. Astronomers using the James Webb Space Telescope think they've found something incredible. A brand new planet orbiting Alpha Centauri. A, a star. This isn't some distant, unreachable world on the other side of the galaxy. This is practically our cosmic neighbor. And if this discovery is confirmed, it could be one of the most important finds in the history of space exploration. Let's picture where this is. The Alpha Centauri system is made of three stars. Alpha Centauri A, Alpha Centauri B, and a smaller red dwarf called Proxima Centauri. We already know Proxima has a planet, but it's not exactly friendly to life. It gets blasted by dangerous flares from its star. Alpha Centauri A, on the other hand, is calm, steady. If a planet is orbiting there, it could be in a much more welcoming environment. So how did scientists even see this planet? It's not like you can just point a telescope and snap a photo. Stars are so bright, they completely hide planets next to them. But the James Webb Telescope has a special tool called a coronagraph. It blocks the star's light, kind of like putting your hand up to block the sun so you can see something faint in the distance. Using this, Webb spotted a tiny, dim object, about 10,000 times fainter than the star itself. The data suggests this is probably a gas giant, maybe something like Saturn. Now, I know what you're thinking. Gas giants aren't great for humans to live on. True, but here's the exciting part. Gas giants often have moons, and moons can be rocky with oceans and atmospheres. In our own solar system, moons like Europa and Enceladus might already have the ingredients for life. So imagine if this new planet had moons like that, right next door in cosmic terms. This find is even more exciting because of how close it is. Four light years means that with the right technology, a small probe could get there in just a few decades. That's not science fiction. Projects like Breakthrough Starshot are already planning tiny spacecraft that could reach Alpha Centauri within a human lifetime. Until now, those missions focused on Proxima Centauri's planet. But now, we may have a bigger, better target. And here's the game changer. It's the first time we've directly seen a planet around a sun-like star this close to us. Most of the thousands of exoplanets we know were discovered indirectly by watching stars dim or wobble. But with this, we've actually taken a picture of it. That's rare. And once you can see a planet directly, you can study its atmosphere, its temperature, maybe even spot signs of life. Of course, we have to be cautious. Scientists haven't fully confirmed this is a planet yet, more observations will be needed. Using JWST again and future telescopes like the extremely large telescope in Chile, they'll figure out its orbit, its size, and whether it really is a planet or something else, like a brown dwarf or a dust cloud. But if it is confirmed, it will instantly become one of the most studied worlds in the night sky. The Alpha Centauri system has always been a favorite in science fiction, from Avatar to Interstellar. But now, it's not just fiction we could actually send probes there. One day, we might see real photos of this planet and its moons, not just artists' illustrations. And who knows what we'll find when we get there. Think about it. Somewhere just four light years away, there could be an ocean moon with alien fish swimming under the ice, or a rocky world with blue skies and green landscapes. And right now, for the first time in history, we might have spotted the place to look. So the next time you look up at the night sky, remember, our next big adventure in space might not be to Mars or Jupiter, but to a world just around the corner. And if life is out there, they might already be watching us too.